They say you can't grow wings and fly away, but nobody ever said anything about becoming Kirby and flying away. I mean, it's a thing that you can do, right? Especially if you have an inflatable Kirby costume, right? The sky is the limit. That's what I've been trying. I've been trying to fly as Kirby. I definitely have tried. It didn't work, but I tried. If you've tuned into the channel over the past few days, you have likely seen my short unboxing of the insane surprise that Nintendo sent over to celebrate Kirby's 30th anniversary and the launch of Kirby and the Forgotten Land. Seriously, I have to send a huge thanks over to my friends at Nintendo for this. I didn't expect any of it, and as a huge Kirby fan, I am just ecstatic. This is so cool. I'm beyond excited for the Forgotten Land later this month. It's gonna be awesome. If you didn't already know, Nintendo did drop a demo for Kirby and the Forgotten Land on the Switch eShop, so if you're interested in the game, you can head on over there right now to play it. It's a lot of fun, and there are also two exclusive codes that you can get by playing the demo to use in the full version of the game. You'll get one code just by completing the demo, and another one by 100%ing it. I am all for a good Kirby game and the Forgotten Land is shaping up to be one of Kirby's best adventures yet. I'm so excited for the full game. Anyway though, back to the surprise package. If you saw my short unboxing a few days ago, you know all that was in here. Nintendo sent this super cool Warp Star Kirby shirt, which I'm rocking right now. They also sent this adorable Club Mochi Mochi anniversary, 30th anniversary Kirby plush, which is awesome because I was literally shopping around everywhere for a Nintendo themed pillow for my new studio setup here and now I don't have to look any further. This Kirby plush is perfect, and it's just without question the most adorable thing that I have ever seen. Just look at this guy, look at him! There was also that Kirby inflatable costume. Now, I didn't even know a Kirby inflatable costume was a thing before, but I never knew how much I needed it. I've been having much more fun with this thing than I should be. You basically just step inside, zip it up, and there's a clip-on battery pack that you switch on and it inflates in a few minutes. The battery pack is powered by standard AA batteries, so it's super easy to work with. With. I think I know what I'm gonna be rocking to Comic-Con and a few other cons in the future. If you see Kirby, you definitely know who it is. I think the biggest surprise for me out of everything that Nintendo sent though was that first four figures, Kirby and the Gold Door figure. Like this thing took me by surprise. I totally didn't see it coming. This figure is absolutely stunning. It's a nine inch PVC figure with a gorgeous amount of detail, but it doesn't just stop at that. This figure also has touch controls built into the flowers that allow Kirby Kirby to spin and dance to his iconic victory theme by the gold door. It's adorable. This is definitely a figure that I will no doubt be proudly having on display. And that was it. Again, I just wanted to share these fun and awesome surprises that Nintendo sent over in a little bit of a longer video. It was just super cool and unexpected in every sense of those words. Every time Nintendo sends over a surprise, they always one up themselves and I don't know how they do it. This was absolutely incredible. And as a huge Kirby fan, I'm just so grateful. Thank you once again to Nintendo for all these awesome surprises. Happy 30th to Kirby. Cheers to many more and to Kirby and the Forgotten Land. It's be an awesome game. So that's about it for this video, my friends. I really do hope that you enjoyed it. If you did and you liked what you saw, be sure to give it a thumbs up and hit that subscribe button because it always helps out the channel. Also, don't forget to follow at Racetrasis on Twitter and Instagram for much more. Until the next one, I will catch you guys later. Peace!